raining? Are you shitting me? I don't, I don't know if I find this ironic or not because, hello. I'm not shitting you, it just turned the camera on and it just like started raining. What, what the fuck? What the hell? We're gonna keep going anyway. Well, hello, my fellow nerds, and welcome back to another episode of Watch Me Work, where you see me try attempt to work on various things, and I do succeed, but at the same time, it's a dangerous process. Dangerous. Oh my! Oh god! I knew it was all god! It hit my leg! It hit my leg! So it's, um, I'm taking one for the team, so it works out perfectly. For this particular episode of Watch Me Work, you'll be seeing how I did the wig for my Katara cosplay from the Amber Island arc. To start out this episode, we're going to talk about the wig. I know, it looks weird, doesn't it? Now, when it comes to finding wigs, it becomes like the needle in a haystack search to find exactly what you want. If you somehow just eBay search a basic wig, you're going to get like oh, 10,692 choices. That's a lot of choices. And for this particular style, Katara just has like a beach wave hair. It's not that wild, but something a little more tame. And the way that I found specifically was actually a scarlet witch wig. I'm like, same style, works out, has the part that I want, has the length, perfect. Bought it immediately. And I saw that it fit absolutely perfectly. It was able to cover everything and be able to use it as my disposal and then first I realized I, uh, I look like I'm a chick at a Led Zeppelin concert so I had to go ahead and get that on my system and then finally go ahead and start styling the wig. Now for certain characters I have like a half up half down hairstyle where they have just a little half bun on their head. This is what I do to be able to get kind of give it volume without having to do like a regular bun and then you wouldn't have enough hair and for animated characters for some strange reason they have more hair than I think they should possibly have hair for, somehow adding volume. So this is something that I've done for years for various characters that have a bun, is to take a little hair clamp, I don't know what it's called, but that thing right there, and as soon as I got the exact length that I wanted, making sure that I had enough hair on top, but also enough hair to do the little side pieces, which I'll explain later, I put that on top and then I circled it around and it just kind of went counterclockwise and then clockwise and back again until it was all covered and neat and I took like a whole shit ton of bobby pins and pinned it into place. <laughs> Actually, you know, I'm cosplaying someone that's it, kind of in the Fire Nation, so I had to get burned really quick. Okay. Ow! I just backed him into that! Only I could pull that off. For the little pieces right here, after I sectioned the pieces that I wanted, most people use like hair ties, but I wanted something that would kind of help me out a little bit better, so it was more secure, and I used black zip ties. I just took the hair, folded it, zip tied it in place. That way I could be sure that it stayed absolutely secure and have to worry about anything and I just hairsprayed it in place. And like the leftover pieces that were folded that kind of went up, you can either have the option of either cutting that piece or just folding it into the hair like I've done. I just sort of folded it into the curls and started a very curly wig. It just kind of folds in place. And that's everything I did to do my Katara wig. It really wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be, really. I thought it was going to be something ten times harder, but it wasn't. I'm going to be debuting this character at Anime Mid Atlantic in a couple weeks, and I am so excited for it because I have a group, and we're going to, and I have a friend who's going to Zuko, and I get to unleash the inner child that shamelessly loved that couple and do so many shipping pictures, so be prepared for a, a lot of that. I mean, there's, it's going to be some shameless shipping going on. It's, Thank you so much for watching this episode of Watch Me Work. If there's a specific item or wig or anything in general you would like to see me work on, please feel free to comment that down below. Also, check out my series called Cosmic Chronicles and you can see the entire walkthrough of a character, prop, wig, all that stuff. It gets covered on that specific series. And as always, I can't start stress this enough. You stay awesome, my fabulous nerds. You take care now. Bye-bye! It's fucking
fucking raining. I mean, how convenient is that? I just, I just, I just pressed the button and just, it's just. Rain, water, earth, fire, air. Avatars. You know, avatars.